Absolute disgrace. Re referees I've ever seen. My God. Boxing Day football is finally back. Hope you guys had a Merry Christmas. And we're playing Plymouth Argyle at the Cardiff City Stadium today. Uh, last time we played them was actually on Boxing Day, way back in 2009. Less said about that result and less said about where Plymouth ended a few years later. But apart from that, team news has just come out. So Anakin Goal, NG McGuinness, Gutas and Jamalou Collins at the back with a midfield duo of Ryan Wintle and Joe Rawls. Manolas Chopis has been dropped. I can understand why because of some really poor performances as of late. Ruben Cowell in the middle and then a front three of Mete, Grant and Itete. On the bench, Runnison, Panzer, Romeo, Adams, Chopis, Sawyers, Tanner, Bowler and Callum Robinson. So no strikers on the bench for today. Well, no out and out strikers. You could probably argue with that uh, Robinson is one. But look, a very, 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 very lucky result last time out against Sheffield Wednesday away in the 90-something minute. Got away with it again, but we got to sharpen up our performance is desperately and hibernate until January when some, a certain someone who is at the game today only just found out about that one. Um, yeah, let's just say he needs to um, he needs to either get spending or get finding some players. But aside from that, let's do it. Thoughts on today then? Yeah, Merry Christmas to all the viewers of this channel, Nathan. Um, especially if you're a Cardiff City fan and a Welsh fan anywhere in the war for this match. Yeah, we haven't been playing well, have we, for the past oh, six weeks or something like that. Sheffield Wednesday, got to say, it was lucky, a lucky ricochet to uh, to, to score that goal by a tete, or it just sort of come off the defender, didn't it? But hopefully we can get back to winning ways again today, Boxing Day. I, I can't recall many Boxing Day victories over the decades we've been watching. Cardiff City, but hopefully we'll be able to bring all three points. It's really good that Colwell's playing today. Defence at the moment kind of pits itself, doesn't it? And uh, Siopis on the bench. Yeah, his performances recently haven't hasn't been up to it. As in, I mean, a bit of a rest for him, and hopefully he'll come back firing in the next game, or you'll probably get an opportunity to get on on the field this afternoon later on in the game, I should imagine. But hopefully we can have a little bit of entertainment today because. Just watching Cardiff City has been a, a little bit dull, well, more than a bit dull, hasn't it? Hopefully we will win. Plymouth, I don't want to say it, but we know the form that they've been away from home. And what usually happens when they come up, or a team comes up against Cardiff City, yeah, it's uh, it's not a favourable result for the Bluebirds. So hopefully we can get all three points today, and that'll be a, a fantastic Christmas present. <laughs> a joke. Of course it has to be him. Oh my god, wake up! Terrible! Come on! Hey, finally! Oh my god, this not need to wake up. God, Engie's actually giving him assist. Wait, come on! 
Oh, this is horrendous. lads even though it was an own goal I'll take it I will absolutely take it fucking useless da, 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 over there and it's all gone quiet all gone quiet all gone quiet over there well it's what we are me well it's what we are me sing when you're winning sing when you're winning you only sing when you're winning Okay, so that's the end of the first half, 1-1. One, one. Once again, it's saved by a very dodgy own goal. First of all, um, yeah, the goal we can see is absolutely shocking, and of all the people I didn't want to score it, he ends up going to score it, doesn't he? Uh, Collins, let's just say, ball watching once again. But aside from that, the pass back, absolutely hilarious. I mean, it happened to us against Sheffield Wednesday, where they scored that own goal, mind it was um, quite well assisted by our performance, in particular in the 80th minute. But, but the one thing I will say once again is that that start of the first half was the most Cardiff City thing ever. We were just completely out of it, grew back into it slowly, but we've got to be really careful in the second half because they can easily pick us here. But yeah, that's what I'm most worried about, to be honest. So all I'll say to the boys is wake up. What do you think? I don't know. I think performance-wise, that's probably the best we've played in about five or six weeks. Well, you're just saying something. No, I think played really well. Um, horrendous goal though to give away. Oh, I know. Should have cut off the cross from the from the from the left back or the right back rather, Perry and G side, and they just slotted it in. But, uh, yeah, as you say, Whitaker put in was uh, a bit of, a bit of taste in the mouth, but uh, they made a, they made a right hash of their goal as well. Their keeper and the defender messing up for, and I, I think we probably used up our quota for good luck for the. For the whole of the season, the oh, last I couple think of games, so, I know. Wednesday and again today, but um, I thought we probably edged it in the first half. They scored from their what their first opportunity. We had a couple of other shots, but we've had a you know, three or four opportunities. Apart from that, I'd say we're just about on top. But yeah, if the crowd can get behind us, second half, then uh, we should take all three points. Oh my God! Come on! Come on! <laughs> what a goal! Oh, man's a game. Oh, that was a few goals in two games. Brilliant. Whoa! Oh, come on. Oh, Colwell, that is disgusting. Shoot! Shoot! Keep battling, come on. Gee, see that first touch, man, come on. Come on, boys. Unlucky. Come on, third one's coming. No, 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 no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Say it, say it. Oh my God. It was going to happen, wasn't it? Jinxed it earlier. God's sake. Oh, come on! 
No idea what that was then from Riles. Flipping heck. <coughs> Come on, eyes open, ref. At least the officer's coming on, I guess. Oh, God. Oh, my God, off the bar. <coughs> you watch that, I'll get out of jail free card now. My God. We nearly let him just score a hat trick. It's just ridiculous. Oh, I need to wake up. Go. Come on. Shoot. Perry's there, he's open, come on. Oh, lucky. Come on, have some more of that. Come on, boys. Come on! What? Not even anywhere near the ball. Come on. Hey, come on! Silly! Oh my god. We need to wake up. That's lovely. Go on. Oh yeah, yeah. Get on to it. Oh my God. Oh, how have we not scored that? Oh my God. Oh, this has just been a typical Boxing Day performance for us, hasn't it? You are so probably go on and win now. Yeah, here they go. Look at Robbo! There we go, come on! Shoot! Oh my god! We still got it! Get it through! Yes! Oh, corner ball! Corner! Corner! What? What? Oh my god! Oh, fraud! Oh, that's ridiculous! Dear, oh dear. Oh, that's all over. Typical. We never win on Boxing Day, do we? 2-2. Desmond, of course, Whitaker. Of all people, had to score those two goals. And yeah, in bits, we played really well. In other bits, we were absolutely terrible. Just didn't know what to do with the ball. Silly mistakes. Just the list goes on and on and on. Individual performance is a bit iffy. The substitution sadly didn't work either, so... Yeah, just another one of those days, isn't it? What do you think? Here at 2-1, I thought we were we were comfortable, weren't we? Yeah, yeah we were. Really, his strike was excellent. You know, he could have skied that, he could have gone wide, he could have pulled it. But he, he took it really well. And then up to about 60-odd minute, I think it was the substitutions, both Colwell and Rolls both went off. And it, it kind of changed, didn't it? And I think they scored pretty much, you know, a few minutes later. And it was two all, and then it could have gone either way. I think they hit the bar, didn't they? Now it made a, a decent save or two, and their keeper was lucky with one of the shots that sort of, I'm not sure who it was at the back post. It might have been NG or something, or, or um, Wintel, and uh, could have scored from that as well. And the officiating, again, they were, it was so suspect in that second half. They were going down, like holding their heads, really like stop him play and stuff but there was one decision right at the end absolutely diabolical from the official the officials wasn't it, it clearly went out Teams for a corner. corner 95th minute still had about what 20 seconds left on it and it should have been a corner and uh, you never know what could have happened you know Missed might, again might have not come to anything week. but you know we should have won but Plymouth as well. It was a game we could have lost as well. It could have gone either way really at the end, but uh, at least it was entertaining. It was probably the most entertaining match for well for a while anyway. Yes. Even you know matches where we've won, I thought it was a it was a decent enough performance. Okay, there was mistakes. Um, you can see why Plymouth concedes so many goals as well because they're wide open sometimes. And well, the biggest mistake was from their keeper. One it has. Oh, that was horrendous. Yeah, but. Uh, 
four points from six from two matches of a festive period we've got enough two matches to go we're going to be really tough i know qpr lost to millwall today but we got leicester on friday which is going to be so so difficult to get anything from hopefully the the crowd will be up for that because it was a little bit flat today at well for most of the part so hopefully the fans can get up for that get a bit of bite and edge to the game against leicester surely we can come out but uh, overall okay we didn't win and a bit disappointed but um a bit happier than we have been for in recent weeks apart from the end of that Sheffield Wednesday match of course oh yeah that was excellent but aside from that it's, it's been slowly getting better and better hasn't it but just gotta wait until wait and see what we do in January now and hibernate till January but if you haven't joined please don't like comment subscribe to the channel that would be appreciated follow all social medias in the description below and I'll see you all next time for that Leicester game au revoir